a wide open space just west of Kingston, Oklahoma, fittingly known to the locals as Crossroads, where highways 32 and 377 cross. You see a lot of truckers and on a pretty day, a few bikes and old friends. But inside this little building on the big prairie is what some call a hamburger heaven. Can it get these all? Two cheeseburgers and a bacon cheeseburger. April Bellaville is one of the ladies heading up the kitchen. I get here at 5 in the morning uh -huh. and I start cooking the sausage and baking the biscuits. Yeah, they do breakfast too, but today, folks, we're here for the burgers and for the company. Meet the owner of Crossroads. Everybody calls me a haircut. Why does everybody call you a haircut? It ain't because he's cutting hair. <laughs> <laughs> it's a nickname I got at dear old pal high school back in the 50s. My name is Larry Lee. For the past 22 years, the place to find Larry, or haircut, is right behind that cash register, and he says a lot has changed. Yes, ma'am, in 1994, $700 was a good day. I kid you not. But gas was 99 cents back then. Diesel was like 80 cents. Now he's turned what was a little tiny gas station into a booming burger-making business. When I bought this out, I had a little bitty grill, a little electric grills. And we might kick, the feed mill was our main customer. We might cook four or five a day. Then we went to a bigger grill. Then we went to a bigger grill. And now we need a bigger grill. On an average day, they say they crank out 50 to 60 pounds of hamburger meat. April said that comes up to about 90 patties a day. I'm trying to get them all the same thickness so they'll cook all the same. Haircut said these are not your normal quarter pounders. They make sure every patty is packed with seven ounces of hearty beef made just like Mama would. Just like cooking at home, you know. Love and touch. That's right. Always cook with love. Always. And thanks to word of mouth, tourists, truck drivers, the craving for the flavor is spreading. People come from Dallas, Fort Worth, Oklahoma City, all over the country, truck drivers have spread the word about our hamburgers. Just ask their loyal customers. So why do you come in here? Well, it's close to home. we got good hamburgers. And other stuff, too, is good. I noticed there's not much left. You're right. I'll beat it all up. <laughs> Try haircuts. Uh, we, have, we have truck drivers that come to our facility a lot, and we send them down here, and they all comment how much they like it. Even if it's not a burger you're craving, these folks can hook you up. So you come into Crossroads Diner, you order a burger, and you see, what do you find? Fried bologna sandwiches. I haven't had one of these since I was a kid, and let me tell you, it looks yummy. Thank you, April. Mmm. <laughs> Hot off the grill. And you can't forget the fresh cut fries or the onion rings. Whether you're here to get your burger on or just see some old friends. The customers are great. They're really great. They come in first, they know me first name. They walk in or like, hello, April. Even Haircut says he's been surprised at the success. Who can explain it? Home cooking. Home cooking, exactly. And most likely that down home treat you like family atmosphere. Stop in and see us. Buy some gas, some beer, ice, whatever, you know. We'll bet we'll be nice to you. Maybe you'll come back. I bet you do. Discovering Oklahoma, just outside of Kingston, I'm Lisanne Anderson.